issue here was uh, we used to, uh, you know, the guys used to bring the uh, Menards pallets. Uh -huh. uh, and we used to have, you know, like uh, polar pallets, uh, shorter pallets. And we didn't know which one uh, to stack on top of which, you know. Right. Uh, so sometimes we used to stack, you know, like a bigger pallet on top of the small pallet. You know, because we didn't have other options. And it would squish the product, yeah, so you'd have a defect. Yep. yep. And now, you know, with another, uh, you know, with this, uh, uh, like, uh, spreadsheet that we're making, now we know uh, where to stack every pallet, you know. And it's uh, easier and it's faster for us. Now the, the pickers bring the pallets, and we just, we just mark them down with numbers. And, uh, you know, and after that, we know where to stack each pallet. So as you can see, you know, like, see this pallet is 900 pounds mm -hmm. and this one on top is 297. So right here on my sheet, you have this, this pallet right here as number four and this right here 297 as pallet number four. So that's how we, that's how we condense the pallets, you know, and it's easier for us, you know, just to stack them on top, number them down and easy simple awesome. and fast. I usually divide, you know, the weight divided by the, the number of pallets. Okay. And I'll, I'll get, you know, like an estimate of how much weight per, per stack. Perfect. So after that, you know, I start figuring, you know, making my numbers. Okay, so I'm going to do like uh, double stacks or triple stacks. Or it can be like one triple stacks and the rest can be like double stacks. So and how much time do you think that saved you? It'll save me like probably like from 30 to 45 minutes. Every time, every, every time. time. So yeah. every Menards, and how many Menards do we pick a week? Nine? Nine. Wow, nine so that's almost nine hours. Nine hours, yep. A week much, yep. that you can spend doing other things. Yep, helping the guys pick or do something else. Perfect, nice job, Thank high you. five.